right all God says there's a married couple that they are trying to, for a baby and he hears your prayers because it doesn't seem to be happening for you he said it will on his timing be patient and to relax there's someone that attends the church and God says this person wants to join the worship team and have been told they can't they don't need anyone else he says he hears your prayers wash his hand he said you will get on the team and he's so happy that this is something you want to do for him. The someone is praying to God and has a court summons because they're being sued. And God says, you are stressing out. He says, don't worry, he has got you. He will help you throughout the court case and wait for his unexpected surprise he will do for you. Matthew 7, 7. Ask and it shall be given to you. Seek and ye shall find, knock, and the door will be open unto you. 1 Corinthians 10.31 So whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all for the glory of God. 1 Corinthians 6.19 Do you not know your bodies are temples of the Holy Spirit who is in you, whom you have received from God? You are not your own. 1 Corinthians three sixteen seventeen. Do you not know that you are God's temple and that God's spirit dwells in you? If anyone destroys God temple, God's temple, God will destroy him. For God's temple is holy, and you are that temple. Leviticus nineteen twenty eight. You shall not make any cuts on your body for the dead, or tattoo yourselves. I am the Lord. 1 Corinthians six twenty. For you were bought as a, at a price, so glorify God in your body. 1 Corinthians 6.18 Flee from sexual immorality. Every other sin a person commits is outside the body, but the sexual immoral person sins against his own body. Romans 12.1 I appeal to you, therefore, brothers, by the mercies of God, to present your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your spiritual worship. My dearest children, remember your body is a temple for my Holy Spirit, so I need you to be careful with your body, like what you put into it, and also the sin you cause using your body. I want a pure relationship with you, where it's just you and me, and not anything else that may harm you or our relationship. If you are unsure about what could affect my temple, Come to me and talk to me, and if you are doing anything that is affecting the temple and you find it hard to stop, come to me, ask for help, and I will help you. It won't take overnight to fix some things, but we can always just make a start. With all my love, Daddy God, peace be with you. Thank you God for placing this video in front of those who need to see it. If you feel led to serve into this ministry, click the link in the description box below. I am taking orders for personal prophetic words. Email me at desertrose6655 at gmail.com. Not every prophetic word is for you, but if you feel it is, take the Lord for guidance. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more encouraging words from your loving Father, the Creator and Almighty God. Thank you.